Hoki mai ano, welcome back. Police, Oranga Tamariki, foreign affairs and immigration officials are looking into allegations of coerced marriages, rape and human trafficking at Gloria Vale's sister community in India. It comes after two former members of the West Coast Commune travelled to India to visit the site. Here's our investigations correspondent, Michael Mora. In the state of Tamil Nadu in India... We hear the check on those girls. Two former members of Gloria Vale's New Zealand chapter are on a mission. With hidden cameras rolling, their experience was documented in a multi-part series on TVNZ. How's it going? Yes. Rosanna came with me. What they found has in part prompted action from lawyer Deborah Manning. I wrote to the relevant agencies raising concerns of what appears to be potential trafficking of women from Gloria Vale to India and coerced marriage. This woman, known as Precious, came to India seven years ago after Gloria Vale's leaders asked her to fly over and marry an Indian man. She didn't have her passport and there appeared to be no formal record of the babies being born here. Gloria Vale's leader in India, Faithful Stronghold, then made a disturbing admission when the visiting women raised concerns about sexual abuse. What is rape? Raping is, it happens from one side. Yeah. Indian men are very forceful around women. It's part of the culture, and there's a lot of Indian men who force themselves onto a lot of women mm. because of shortage of ladies in India. Yes, that's an extremely concerning statement, particularly in the context of what we know about the glory of our community. What we know, as detailed in multiple court cases, is that women are controlled. A forensic psychiatrist said during a recent case, women living in a coercive or socially entrapped environment have restricted autonomy and are disempowered from making independent choices and decisions. Police have confirmed to News Hub that they have received a formal legal letter and they're assessing it in conjunction with other relevant agencies. Manning says government agencies have taken her complaints seriously. They have taken immediate steps since being contacted. Well, what does that mean, immediate steps? So there have been a number of cross-sector coordinated um, meetings and interviews are being set up to speak to relevant individuals. But Gloria Vale denies any issues, saying no one has complained and that women went to India to marry of their own free will and with the convictions they had in their own hearts. Some have returned to New Zealand and then gone back. But lawyer Brian Henry doesn't buy those explanations. We've always said that Christianity is a cloak for uh, sexual misbehaviour. He's now lodged a case against government agencies claiming they have failed to do their jobs. And they haven't looked after the victims, that's why the proceedings are coming. So a lot more to come on this secretive society, both here and abroad. Michael Mora, News Hub.